I'm Steve Vecchioni for Navigators TV. What an evening tonight here at Fraser Field, the 79th anniversary of the opening of this ballpark. And we have three UMass Lowell players to be. They're going to play at UMass Lowell next season. They made their Navigators debut tonight, and all three excel. I've got Keegan Calero and the two pitchers tonight, Cam Sagan and Blake Bennett. Let me start with Keegan. You had a single and a triple in your debut. Yeah. How did it feel out there playing the infield, getting up at the plate, going uh, two for two in your first two at-bats? Yeah. I mean, I was, I was I was obviously in there. It was my debut today with the uh, bigger guys, especially coming straight from high school. But I felt pretty good. I felt like I belonged here, and I felt, I felt good. So I'm happy to, to go forward with you guys. What was your approach at the plate tonight? Up the middle. Up the middle. Don't try to pull in things, stay and go back up the middle. All right, so your two teammates at UMass Lowell came in in relief. Cam, you had a lot of strikeouts in prep baseball, and you came in tonight, you had six strikeouts in two innings of pitching. What worked for you tonight? Uh, my curveball was working really well. Uh, I was able to dump it in the zone uh, almost every time. It, it felt good, and then when I needed to snap it down and get it in the dirt, I could. Uh, the catcher did a great job blocking everything, so I was really confident in myself tonight. Yeah, you had two runners on base in your first inning, and you had to work out of trouble. What was your approach in the the batter Cawley in his at bat? Uh, I mean, that's what's nice about playing up here with the, the quality of guys that are on the field now. Uh, I trust everybody behind me, so just let the ball get put in play, and somebody's gonna make the play behind me. And that's why everybody's here, right? All right, again, six strikeouts in two innings. Then Blake Bennett, you made your debut tonight. Comes in on the ninth inning. You get two strikeouts, not quite six and two innings, but good enough. Um, so you've seen what your teammates were doing, and you come in. What, what were you thinking at that point? Well, I'm going to do better than Cam. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we're roommates next year, so we're going to be competitive all year. And uh, I don't know, that goes for the whole pitching style. So we're going to carry this year, all this season, and the next season. So hopefully we get some good, good innings and look up for stuff. What, what does it mean to you to play with your teammates uh, as a navigator? I mean, I've been, I've been waiting for a while. I've been waiting for a while to have the guys in the bump in front of me. So happy and I'm looking forward to it. What does it mean to you? I can't wait. I mean, he's a stud. I've heard all about him. Can't wait to have him behind me in the middle. It's and your fault? And your fault? Yeah, this is my first time actually talking to Keegan today. Me and Kay, I talked a little bit. But um, yeah, no, I can't wait. Well, a great evening for UMass Lowell players in their debuts here on the 79th anniversary at Fraser Field. A big 7-3 win for the Navigators over Pittsfield tonight. They remain in first place, their 10th win of the season. Here on Navigators TV, I'm Steve Vecchioni.